بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم مائی نیم از اسد یعقوب اینڈ آئی ایم فرام پاکستان اینڈ آئی ایم یور پرسنل آن لائن آئلس کوچ اوکے اینڈ آئی ایم گوئنگ ٹو گائڈ یو ان آئلس ریڈنگ ریڈنگ ول ناٹ بی اے پرابلم ود آئلس کوچ اسد یعقوب اوکے اینڈ آئی ایم ریلی تھینکفل ٹو یو فار یور کامنٹس اینڈ فار لائکنگ مائی ویڈیوز اکراس دا ورلڈ اسپیشلی فرام پاکستان انڈیا بنگلہ دیش نیپال اینڈ مڈل ایسٹ and the countries like UAE. Thank you very much for your messages. Thank you very much for your comments. I really appreciate that. Anyways, the next type of question which I'm going to discuss with you that is called summary completion. What do we call it? Summary completion. The examiner will give you a summary with the blanks and you got to complete that very summary. Now sometimes they take information from one portion of the passage and sometimes across the passage. But the answers are going to be in the passage order in summary completion. What you need to do before you do this question, you have to read the summary and you need to underline the clue words so that you could reach the part of the passage and once you find the answer of one question or the first question then you need to read on you will find the next answer then you read on you'll find the next answer and like that okay so let's just read this together i'm showing you this yeah can you see that okay salt is such an dash that people would not be able to live without now it can be like ingredient it can be item it can be thing so you got to see that salt is something and people cannot live without now what is it what is that thing the the specific word they use i can easily put salt is such an an important ingredient but that will be wrong and n means the word is going to start with the vowel a e i o u so you need to see what is that that the salt is and n means it's going to be a noun okay anyways as well as its uses in cooking this basic mineral has thousands of business now thousand you got to look for the word thousand and then you got to look for the word business thousands of business okay let's do question number 17 and we got to keep in mind salt is such a thing that people would not be able to live without let's just see that all right i found it easily okay because i did that before look at this paragraph but salt is also an essential element without it life itself would be impossible now life itself would be impossible or people cannot live without so what is that salt is an uh, is also an essential element the answer is going to be essential element clear all right don't worry i'm with you yeah your coach is with you you don't need to worry about anything you only have to perform and i'll take your worries now the next is uh, as well as its uses in cooking now the clue word one is cooking and second is thousands of business now what is that business cooking right and then the word thousand if you find any number which is in thousand that can be a very nice clue word any number that is in thousand let's see yes 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 i found it i found it it's here please watch carefully and while we are familiar with its many uses in cooking we may not be aware that this element is used in some 14000 commercial applications 14000 commercial applications and by the way we went through this before as well when we were doing the other questions so the answer is going to be thousands of business applications okay 14000 commercial applications in the passage they're using the word commercial and here they're using the word uh, business so it's going to be applications let's read ahead ranging from making paper to the manufacturers of soap being apprised and dash it has played a major part in the economies of many countries now the word economy you have to look for the word economy right where you find the word economy there you will find the answer being apprised and dash it has played a major part in the economies of many countries now let's see where is economy where is economy yes i found the word economy please follow me as a precious and portable commodity salt has long been a cornerstone of economies now we got to read portable commodity 
as a precious and portable commodity, salt has long been a cornerstone of economies. Let's see. Yeah, the question is being a prized and now one is prized and being a prized and portable commodity exactly as a precious now precious is the word for prized and is portable commodity so it's going to be portable commodities that portable commodity that is going to be the right answer it has played a major part in the economies of many countries got it okay well done let's go ahead as such salt has not only led to war now they are talking about war because of salt but has also been used to raise dash by governments in many parts of the world now they use salt to raise something in men by the governments now what you got to see what is in the authority of the government what is it that the government can raise in many parts of the world and they did that while using salt so the clue words are governments and the parts of world for parts of world you can see the names of the countries you can see many other countries you can see various countries or different countries of the world let's just see that okay i got it please follow me in 2200 bc the chinese emperor his year you levied one of the first known taxes he taxed salt now what did he do he actually taxed salt so you got to see the word is uh, one of the first known taxes that tax was uh, uh, that text was levied by that Chinese emperor. So Chinese emperor is basically the government. As uh, such salt has not only led to war but has also been used to raise taxes by governments in many parts of the world. And if you want to see many parts of the world then it's mentioned in Tibet Marco Polo noted that and then they talk about other parts. You uh, uh, there is the Ethiopia there then there are the other, other places as well. Clear? The answer is going to be taxes. If it's not clear, rewind the video a little and watch it again. Next is, there are also many instances of its place in religion and culture. Now the role of salt in religion and culture being used as a means to get rid of evil now here the clue word is evil religion belief you got to keep this in mind i mean sometimes you can keep three four clue words in mind sometimes you need to keep idea in mind that okay i'm looking for evil i'm looking for something which is like evil culture religion and all that so let's look for the word evil yes i found it haha <laughs> okay please watch carefully uh, it says here, I would read the Shinto religion. See the word religion and evil. Shinto religion also uses it to purify an area before sumo wrestlers enter the ring for a match, which is in reality an elaborate Shinto rite. A handful is thrown into the corner. Handful of it means handful of salt is thrown into the corner, into the center to drive off malvolent spirits now malvolent means bad and the word is spirits malvolent spirits means the bad spirits now let's go back there are also many instances of its place in religion and culture being used as a means to get rid of evil spirits malvolent and evil they are the same words they are the similar words so the answer is going to be spirits okay now it's getting tricky because it is section two section two is a little more difficult than section one but don't worry you need to work cunningly in IELTS reading you need to work cunningly you need to work sharply and then you can do that if you like this video please hit on the like button so that I see how many likes are there on my videos and if you want to write any comment or ask any question you can do that in comment and don't forget to subscribe my channel because through this channel I will share more videos on IELTS with you I teach IELTS online through Skype or WhatsApp if you want to join my online classes obviously you can contact me on WhatsApp and I have made an IELTS kit it's basically easy IELTS kit it has four books and eight DVDs and the eight DVDs have my own videos if you want to get that you can also contact me and I'll send you this easy IELTS kit easy IELTS kit will help you prepare for IELTS and get a good band score I wish you all the best and I wish you a very good band score in IELTS reading take care bye bye